GGG, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Your boy's back, codingface.com. Damn, <laughs> All right, listen, man. I'm just having fun out here, man. I just want to let you guys know, you know, your boy's still out here. And I'm still doing one video a day, at least, a minimum, right? So, I'm doing a little 360 in my room. This is my room where I just come here to chill. But, yeah, so, um, let's start it with this, right? So, when are you ready to start applying for jobs, right? Somebody asked me that. He said, hey, Joe, uh, how do I know if I'm ready to start applying for a job? Pretty simple, right? If you could actually, oh, you know, create a website. If I give you a design, right, just a regular design, and you're able to make a website out of that design, like right now, I'll come to dribble.com, right, and say, let's say an example, uh, real estate, right because this is how most of the time this is how you're gonna get you know uh, designs like somebody's gonna come to you and gonna give you a PSD and it's gonna say hey can you make a design out of this right so what you're gonna do is you're gonna come in uh, basically you're gonna scope it out see everything that it has you say okay there's a header uh, you know there's a side menu well there's like you know uh, filters here you have the the apartments, whatever, right? So if you could actually build this, then you're ready to be hired. You know what I mean? Like if you could build an HTML and CSS, you're ready to get hired as a junior developer. You know, just to come in, get your feet wet into the job. I'm, I can't guarantee you you're gonna make a lot of money at first. You might get something like twelve dollars, twelve dollars to let's say. $18, right? And that's fine because you got to understand it's a process. Most companies is going to, you know, that's going to hire you for $12, $13, whatever. They're going to hire you for, you know, for you to get your experience, you know, in, in the company. And basically, it's testing you, you know, in three months, do three months, you know, at that price, right? For an example, sometimes you could get way better than that, you know, better offer than that. But I'm saying for people who who have never worked in the industry, you got to take whatever comes your way. You cannot say, hey, you want to be all picky and say, hey, I want to make $100,000 in my first job that I apply for. Like, you're not being realistic now because, number one, for an example, you might not have a degree. Number two, you don't have enough experience for you to be able to get a higher paying job because a higher paying job means more responsibilities they're not gonna come in and give you a whole project by yourself you're pretty much going to be helping out other developers so if you could actually come in and make this design into you know a real web page you're ready to get a job and you know you start going to indeed.com right you go to indeed.com and you search uh, let's say an example whatever people live wherever you live here right let's say you live in uh, whatever San Francisco right Francisco California and you put in so start checking for junior developer right and then you see this there's a lot of high-paying jobs but in reality I can guarantee you that you're gonna get those jobs I'm being honest with you guys so what you do is you say hey HTML then from there you see even if you if, if you see these jobs are like super high paying jobs apply to it because that's another thing too like you also you're not ready until you start taking interviews like very few people get hired on the first job that they apply for very few people I didn't get hired on my first job that I applied for what I did was I just kept going to interviews I used to go to senior developer positions like interviews and like I would be embarrassed at times I would be embarrassed because they'll ask me questions that I didn't know but then I would go home and be like oh this is why I gotta learn you know what I mean like even if if you can't get the job 
apply for it. See if they hire you. Be like, hey, I already have my, my portfolio. See, you know, come check out the websites that I've made. Look at the small web apps that I've made, my HTML emails, whatever. Whatever you have done, put it into a page. So you could have something like, uh, I don't know, a Joe, a freaking Raul.com. I don't know. Whatever your <laughs> your name and your last name is, right? If you can't find that, then do something your abbreviations or I don't know but have a dot com guys like buy a dot com put use that as a uh, as your portfolio put all your websites and everything that you've built put it there and once you start going to interviews you'll be like hey this is what I did now in the next job they might ask you hey like do you have any experience with angular you'll be like no uh no I don't but I'm a quick learner just keep it you know keep rolling you know what I mean? Like, keep on with the conversation. Don't get stuck. Don't be like, uh, like a lot of people. That's what happens to people. Like, they get fucking scared. Just go to the interview, and then pretty much just you know see what they want. You know, and sometimes even stay in contact with them and be like, hey, send them a little email and be like, hey, how you guys doing? Uh, like even if you didn't get the job, be like, hey, thank you for the opportunity. Da da da. And then, whatever, uh, just stay in contact with them. Just send them an email, like, just to say, hey, thank you for at least giving me the interview. But I'm telling you guys, like, you can find a job. It's, like, it's freaking easy. Like, <laughs> I'm trying not to curse. <laughs> I'm trying to control myself. Jesus Christ. But, yeah, um, yeah, man, just trust me. Like, let's say right now for you guys, like, HTML, right? Junior front end. They have, you know, something 60 grand. And the reason why, you know, maybe San Francisco is not a, a good idea because San Francisco is, like, super expensive. So, what, 60000 in San Francisco is, like, 30000 over there. You know what I mean? Like, it's so expensive that you need a lot of money. They need to pay you a lot of money, even for junior development uh, development um, positions. Like, it's super expensive out there. Maybe let me see... Uh, let me try here in New York. See, maybe give you guys an example. See, like this is more. See, New York is more more reasonable. You know, e a HTML designer, like do little jobs like that. That's like super easy. That's just dealing with HTML tables, and you get paid for it. Like, you know, if you guys could, I'm telling you, if you guys could pretty much just, you know, get a design. Build it in HTML and CSS. And then sometimes they might ask you, hey, could you do a little slider, this and that? Yeah, you could do a slider on jQuery. Like, it's simple, guys. Like, you are ready. Trust me. Just go ahead. Stop being scared. Just start applying. If you're able to basically turn any PSD or any image that's a, uh, a design and you could make it into HTML, CSS, stop playing. Like, go ahead and just start applying. Stop thinking that, oh, I'm not going to get hired. Who cares if they say no on the interview? Like, who gives a... <laughs> I'm about to say, I'm trying to control myself. Who gives a fuck? Like, who gives a fuck if they don't fucking hire you, man? I'm trying not to curse, man. What the hell, guys? What can I do, man, not to curse, man? I'm trying, <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to curse. But, yeah, man, just go ahead, just do your thing. And, and just apply, man. And let me know if you have any problems. Uh, I'm going to continue making videos for you guys. Um, and anyways, you already know. It's CodingFace.com. Make sure you subscribe. Um, these videos are not conventional videos. This is what I call my rants. Videos that pretty much is just ideas that I get. And I just, you know, start blurring it out for you guys. And, and helping you guys out. And hopefully somebody gets something out of this. You know what I mean? Anyways, your boy Joe, back at it again. Bow.